Hello, Reese, Mr. Meow from the Sucklefish Club, and today we are going for a very special episode on Monkey to Mars. Yes, yes, everybody, it is the launch episode, and today we're going to be taking our two tier two rockets and we're going to be going to Mars as Mr. Monkey always wants to go. Mr. Monkey's party joining us today. I know it's the most exciting episode for the series, and I know he probably should be joining us, but he, he really doesn't want to. Neither does Mr. Squiddy. And I think we've all agreed within the Sacrifice Club that we want to stop this series episode on, uh, just stop it to a halt. But we're going to present you with this last episode. Hopefully it'll be great fun. We're going to find Super Dum Dum on Mars and hopefully it should be great. So I guess what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get all the resources required and I'm going to hop into my rocket and Rabbit and I are going to get ready to take off into space. Okay, so we've got our rockets, rockets all ready and we're um, prepared to go up into space. So Rabbit, if you just want to take down the barrier over there, I'm going to let you have the privileges of doing it. And you may have realised we've switched on this lovely little smoke effect, so we should see Rabbit, there we go, so they're slowly disappearing. And uh, we've got this little smoke effect down here to demonstrate how the rockets will be taking off. So let's hop into our rockets and Rabbit, we're going to press it in exactly the same time. So we'll press it in 3, 2, 1. And uh, I, I just heard a smack on it there. But here we go, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, what? 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and let's go! Come on, Rabbit! Oh, look, we're exactly in sync! That's amazing! Okay, remember, my Rabbit, you've got to... Uh, ow! Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Okay, phew, that was very close. You've got to drive yourself in the right direction. Looks like Rabbit's getting stuck down there. Be very careful, Rabbit. Will blow up if you're not careful. Sorry, that's quite discouraging. Is it looking to see that massive rubber tree that Mr. Monkey planted? They're quite dangerous, those rubber trees. They just absolutely wreck your land. That, that was a really nice world until that rubber tree came along. Oh, look like right, looks like rabbits are overtaking me. Oh, you're not going to overtake me. We're going to have a, a space shuttle race. Probably the most dangerous type of race that you can do, but it'll be fun anyway. <laughs> Come on, rabbit. I can. There we go. That's a bit more like it. Big energy boost from us. And what's happened to rabbit? <laughs> he looks like just absolutely falling down there. There we go. There we go. I can get to Mars. Let me go and send myself to this dimension. Rabbit, if you just wait there for a second. Uh, and then hopefully won't crash the server. It looks like I, I'm doing okay here. So, yeah, I'm not crashing. He's just doing some sort of damage now. Rabbit, okay. So, she's sending herself here. And look, we're bouncing. Woo! Woo! Woohoo! Woo! Woo! Remember to hold space. Because I don't, I don't think I can know if you have to. But I'd rather you did. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Boing! Yay! We're back! Come back, see Rabbit up there! Hello, Rabbit! Hello, Rabbit! How are you? How are you? Let's, let's see if he's okay. Did you did you land safely, Rabbit? Did you land nice and safely? Oh, looks like thermal expansion has once, once again bugged out when copying all the pipes in every dimension there is. But looks like Rabbit's here! Hello, Rabbit! You're just bouncing around, having a lovely time. I believe you're in there, so you want to get out of there? You're still bouncing, still bouncing. There we go, Rabbit! We're on Mars! So I guess now- Oh, hello! I can- can I- can I take off again? Can I take off again? <gasps> Ooh, I can take off again. Ooh, this could be exciting, couldn't it? Um, you may realise. Okay, I've got I've got some ad admitting to much to do. This is creative mode pre-fueled. We had to cheat that in because there have been a couple of cuts in this video that really did not go well, and we had to cheat it in. And there's no point paying for more fuel than we did. It was just rabbit screaming about. <laughs> and uh, just some other little mishaps. So yeah, they are pre-fueled. That makes it quite handy though. So let's try and find Mr. Monkey. Where could Mr. Monkey, uh, Mr. Monkey? The super dum dum be. Looks like we're going to have to go, look, 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 what's over here? Interesting. What could this be? I believe these little, um, uh, what are they? They're blue slimeling eggs that you just have to wait next to. And uh, I believe one day they will hatch. So what I'm going to do is I think we're just going to stand here for a little bit and uh, wait for it to hatch and we'll catch you back once it's hatched. Um... I hatch it, do I break it? Nope. Oh, it's a cute little slime thing. What should we call it? What should we call it? Let, let's call it. Hey, wait, wait, I'm, I'm still thinking what to call it. Okay, I'm going to call it Bob the Slime. No, that is just too original of me. Um, <laughs> what should we call it? Rabbit. What should we call it? Let's call it. Hmm. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking something like, hello, slimy, that's a kind of a transfer of hello kitty, no, that does not, that, that doesn't sound right, I don't know what we should call it, what shall we call it, um, uh, I'm not, I'm thinking here, rabbit, do you have any ideas of what we should call it, I don't know, I mean, I'm kind of thinking, um, we should call it, Troy, no, 
grab it. If we have to. Wait, no. oh, what do you mean? I have to go back to my idea. I have to idea. The sucker fish pet. That is more like it. Yeah, yes, that is more like it. The sucker fish pet. I mean, seriously. Yes, that is just good. Okay, <laughs> follow me, the sucker fish pet, because today, what we're going to be. Ow, that was painful. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be heading back to Earth. I wonder if we can go back to Earth. I'm, I'm not sure. But we're going to have to investigate. And if you're allowed to come back to the Earth, and we'll come back to you another time. I'm sure you'll absolutely love it here. So, what we're going to do is I'm going to hop back into my rocket now. And uh, yeah, rabbit, we'll see you on Earth. So, I guess we go 19, 18, 17, 16, 14, 13, 12, 11. I skipped one, didn't I? 10. Six. <gasps> Wait, the sacrifice pet! No, no, stop, stop, abort, 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 abort. No, no, quickly, 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 slimy. Quickly, slimy, slimy. Come on, quickly, slimy, are you okay? Oh, oh my goodness, you scared me so badly there. Oh, the sacrifice pet. Oh dear, I believe your favourite food is emeralds, okay. <laughs> well, you know what? I'm just going to cheat it in. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, this will annoy a lot of you, but seriously, I mean. We cannot let the sacrifice pet die. No, no, we just can't. Uh, we're going to use this to heal him. So there we go. Oh, <laughs> I just hit you straight after I healed you. That was handy, wasn't it? And there we go. There we go. More ammo. Oh, oh, I can pick it again. Yes, so 16. Uh, oh, yeah, we've all got another 64. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Oh, his favourite food is now flint and steel, is it? Okay. Uh, let's have a look then. Flint and steel. It's quite random, the things they eat. I mean, I wouldn't like to eat flint and steel i thought i think that was quite bleh, disgusting can we grow him oh we can grow him oh my goodness rabbit we can actually grow him <laughs> oh my goodness i'm going to keep doing okay i'm going to keep growing him and then i'll see you back in a minute oh look how massive this guy can get he's now the sucker fish pet he's 50 out of 50 health and he's absolutely massive i mean look at that rabbit that's absolutely enormous well, I think we should do now. I think we should leave him here. And uh, we're going to leave him in peace on Mars. Hope he'll have a lovely time. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go and find our rocket to get home. Now, I believe there should, and I mean should here, should be a creative pre-fueled, no, a creative pre-fueled in this one, maybe? I'm not sure, but I hope so. I hope so. Uh, it is, yes, okay, this is a creative pre-fueled. Okay, well, I guess we should get down to what we were originally wanting to do, and that is to actually find Super Dum Dum. The whole point of this series is to find Super Dum Dum, get back to Super Dum Dum, be able to do all that stuff. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to search around for Super Dum Dum a little bit. So, Super Dum Dum, where are you? Hello? Hello? Are you anywhere around here? Hmm, I don't know where she would be. It's a little bit... Hmm. Look, the chunks aren't rendering. The chunks aren't rendering. That's not helping. Minecraft 1.6 dodgy chunk rendering isn't helping me <laughs> in this situation no look here it's a dimensional door i haven't tried these yet on this server and they might work hmm interesting should we go through i don't, I don't think we should go through i think it's a little bit too risky can you walk through it this way without being taken in? yeah you can walk through it the other way oh well um i guess what we should do is just search around super dum dum a little bit so hello super dum dum and oh look he's eating another of these lovely slimeling eggs Wow, we've seen a cat run out there about a billion miles an hour. Uh, look, we can get, we can, maybe we can get another slimeling, a blue slimeling. I believe you can get different coloured slimelings. If we keep hatching this one, uh, we should eventually get a slimeling out of it. That would be very nice, wouldn't it? So, let's see if we can mine this. Come on, come on, get a new slimeling. Yay! Unnamed slimeling! Woohoo! Okay, what should we call it? Let's call it... Let's call it something valid this time. Let's call him Super. Um, hmm, I'm thinking here. Yeah. Something, something that kind of goes in with Super Dum Dum. Super Gloop Gloop. Because he's kind of like Gloop, isn't he? He's kind of Gloop. Oh, uh, Gloop. There we go. Uh, glue. Well, okay. That, that, that also works. Super Gloop Gloop. Uh, I can <laughs> I can do with that. So, are you, are you going to be following me, Super Gloop Gloop? Do you want, do you want to follow me to try and find Super Dum Dum? No? Yes, yes, you follow me, okay. So I guess we just search around the place and oh, oh, oh dear, look what that is over there. Can you can you see over in the distance? There might even be a sign of Super Dum Dum. Hmm.
let's uh, put down these launch pads in um, their kind of three by three pattern. And uh, once they're up, we can put the rocket on there, hop into the rocket, and then we're going to take off. So bye bye, Zephyrish Pet, bye bye, Rabbit. And we'll see you on Earth. So 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woohoo! And we've taken off. Bye bye, Rabbit. Bye bye, the Zephyrish Pet. Bye bye, everybody. Bye any of old creepy bosses that would be on Mars, any nasty creatures. Bye bye everybody. I don't know why we actually took all this stuff because it was pretty pointless, but it doesn't matter because we're saying bye. Bye bye. Bye everybody. Bye. Bye. Okay, looks like we're going to lose radio communication with them down there now. So um, yeah, I guess we're just flying. And it's a shame there isn't a kind of Mars pattern like there is with um, uh, there with the Earth. It's just normal stars, which isn't uh, right because we've only just taken off off Mars. So I guess now we're just going to be flying into the atmosphere. Look, I guess I can see another galaxy over there. Let's go towards the galaxy, see what's in there. <gasps> uh, oh, oh, here we go. So let's go to the overworld because it seems like the place we want to be. And uh, hopefully we should see now. Oh no, not getting stuck in a leaf, but in fact being back at home. Oh, hello. I, I, I can hear. I can hear visitors. I don't want to break this. Oh wow. <laughs> uh, but I think we'd better. Oh dear. <laughs> I think we'd better um, probably go up now. So kind of scared. I don't know what this tree's doing. It's got a bit mad. There we go. I don't know why I even stacked up because I have this um, this lovely little jetpack here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just fall down here. So uh, hopefully I'll be able to save myself at last minute. And ooh, there we go. Once again. Ooh, oh, there it is. There it is. There's our chest. Lovely on the ground. Safe. And we've got all our stuff back. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, yeah, so thank you everybody very much for watching. And we'll see you next time. Oh, wait, actually, I've just remembered. This will be the end of my garage. It's an extremely sad event. Oh, well, thank you for anybody who has watched this series. Because it's been my favourite series to record. And, oh, look, it's the chocolate milk I put down about episode two. Oh, what memories. Oh, dear. It's such a shame to leave this world, but Mr. Sweetie and Mr. Monkey are quite insistent on it. So, I guess what we're going to do now is we're going to end the video. I guess we're going to end the series. I'm going to end anything on this world. I will keep this world saved on my computer. Uh, in fact, I might even leave a world download in the description. Yeah, that might be quite a good idea. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave a world download in the description. And I think for now, Thank you everybody very much for watching Monkey to Mars, and we will see you on Super Dum Dumville. Bye!